Hi guys, welcome to the video. This is Adam from TA Exotics. We're doing egg cutting video today. I've got my daughter Louise doing the filming for me. Uh, she's a bit shy, so she's not going to say hello. Uh, this clutch was the pastel female bred to the pastel catico, and the, the lemon blast was put to her as well. Uh, they're a few days early, um, but as you can see, if you're leaning closer for me, Lou, this little one has come out early, pipped first, and actually made its way out of the egg. Uh, to me, um, it's quite dark, but that looks like a super pastel at the moment. Can't really see any calico in that, but it looks like a super pastel. So we're going to go ahead and open the rest of these. There's another one that's just pipped as well. Um, so we'll go for that one. I've already seen that one. It looks like a normal to me. So we'll very gently just cut the rest of this egg open. Very gunky job. Um, and no, it's not a normal, that is a pastel. A uh, very pretty pastel, actually, as well. So I can cut a bigger hole. Yeah, that's a, that's a really nice pastel, actually. Really nice pastel. Um, so you can sort of see the difference, although it's brighter than that one. Um, that one does look like a super pastel to me, but it's just very dark. So we've got a pastel there. That's good. We'll go for this egg. So we've got in this one. This one looks like another, could be another pastel. Or it could be a normal. Try to be careful not to cut too much of the veins. But they are ready, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Yep, yeah, that's another pastel. Another pastel. Go for this one next. These eggs are lovely and soft, these eggs. The scissors aren't the best scissors though, if I'm honest. Right, what have we got here? That looks like... It looks like a normal, could be a pastel. Could be a normal. Let's we'll wait till that one comes out of the egg. So I've not seen any calico stuff yet, and I've not seen anything from the lemon blast. So I'm unsure who the father is at the moment. Obviously because they both contain the pastel gene. Until this one just popped up, because that one is... By the looks of it, that could be... That's a really pretty one, look at that one. And there we have the calico, so that looks like a super pastel calico to me. Can you see that one? Come closer for me. Yeah, that definitely looks like a super pastel calico. Really high white sides there, absolutely stunning. That'd be nice when it comes out the egg. Okay, so it looks like the pastel calico got the job done. Unless it's a dual side clutch. Do you know what a jaw-side clutch means, Lou? No. So basically that means where the babies could have one, more than one daddy. So two daddies could uh, father this clutch. But so far, it's just the calico. Um, yeah, there we have another pastel calico. So it's definitely the... It's a bit hard to do because my hands are all slimy. But yeah, that looks like a, yeah, that's a pastel calico too. So, boys balls, if you're watching, I know you was after some calico stuff and you was waiting for this clutch in anticipation. Um, there you go, some pastel calico in there. These obviously look a lot more 
um, vibrant once they're out of the egg and once they've shed. Uh, we've got two eggs left. Go for this one. This egg's very dry, there's not a lot of fluid left in this one. So that tells me that it's ready. Remember when you're cutting eggs, you've always got to keep the scissors pointed upwards because you don't want to cut the baby and you don't want to nip too many veins. Mm -hmm. At this stage, it's not that much, you know, not that important about the veins, but because they are ready. And again, another pastel calico. So definitely the pastel calico has got the job done in this instance. Um, so let's cut that flap off, should I? Yeah, pastel calico. So I think I've got um, one super pastel calico and then the rest pastel calicos and maybe that one normal. Because um, if you look at the difference, these two, I don't know how well the camera will pick it up. Can you see the difference between those two? That one's a lot brighter, a lot more blushed out yeah. than that one. So that's telling me that's a super pastel calico and that's just a pastel calico. It's very pretty. They're very pretty, they are. Um, so last egg, it's got a little window there, you see that? Yeah. that you can actually see the baby inside. Oh. Right, last egg. What do you think? Calico? Yeah. Yeah. I think you did a very good job on the camera, Lou. <laughs> Give you a job. What have we got in this one? Again, I think it's another... Uh, okay, this is definitely a super pastel calico. This is stunning. I can see the head on this one. Wow. That is pretty. Can you see that head? Look at the head wow, there. Wow, that's very pretty. That's a super pastel calico. Absolutely stunning baby. Look at that blushed out head with the vein on it. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Um, so maybe this one then that was already out is just a plain pastel calico. Um, you know, the head difference between them, you know, that's definitely not a super pastel calico now, but that one is. So that's really, really cool. Really chuffed with that. Fantastic, so what we got in, in total? So we got, what we got here? So we got a pastel calico there Probably a pastel or normal, definitely a pastel. Um, that could even be, if I can see the head, that could even be a super pastel because that's really bright. But I can't quite see the head. I'm not sure what that is. I can't quite see the head on that one, so we'll call that one a, a super pastel for now. Um, so we've definitely got two super pastel calicos, which is those two there. Pastel calico, pastel calico, pastel calico. So really, really chuffed with that clutch. Really, really happy how that's turned out. Um, the next clutch is due, I think, in two weeks' time, so stay tuned for that one. Um, so please, as always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.